Did you know that you can now set your physical work location in Microsoft Outlook? That's right, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to do it. Let's go ahead and let's dive in. All right, now when you're in Outlook on the web, in the calendar app, you want to click on the settings icon, and then you want to click on view all Outlook settings. Next, you wanna click on work hours and location. And you can see here that this gives you the option to set your work hours and the location per day. Now, if I click on the add location dropdown, you can see here that you can choose to set your location to either working from an office or working remote. Now you can see here that I've gone ahead and I've updated my location for each day of the week. Next, you'll notice this option that says show work location on my calendar. And as you can see, this text here says that your work hours and location can be hidden on the calendar surface, but will still be visible to your colleagues. And we'll go ahead and have a look at what it looks like to other users once you've set your work location in Outlook. Now, a really important note at the time of recording this video, this feature is currently only available in the Microsoft Outlook web app and in the Microsoft Outlook desktop app that was recently released in the public preview program. Now, Microsoft is expected to launch this more broadly in the coming months, and so it's likely that you're going to see it added in the legacy version of Microsoft Outlook as well. All right, now you can see here that I've gone ahead and I've created a new calendar event. Now, when using the scheduling assistant, you'll notice here that next to my name, the work location icon is displayed. Now you can see here that it indicates that on Monday, I will be working remotely. And if I go ahead and change this to Wednesday, you can see here that I've set my work location on Wednesday to be in the office. So this will allow your colleagues to actually view your location and to schedule meetings with you based on whether you'll be working remotely or in the office. Now, if you find this feature helpful, Microsoft has also released a similar feature where you can set your work location in Microsoft Teams. I also have a tutorial outlining how to do that, and I've included a link to that video in the description below, or you can just go ahead and click that card in the upper right-hand corner of your screen and watch that once you finish watching this video. Now you can see here that I've switched to the new Microsoft Outlook desktop app that is currently in public preview. Now to access and set the work location feature in this version of Outlook, you want to click on the settings icon and then click on view all Outlook settings. And then you want to click on calendar and then you wanna click on work hours and location. And you can see here that it displays the exact same menu that we saw when we accessed this feature using Outlook on the web. So that's it. In this video, I demonstrated how you can set your work location in Microsoft Outlook. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please hit that thumbs up below and be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the latest tutorials that I publish. I'm Louis Akabalas. Thanks for stopping by. Talk soon.